minutes away, probably maybe a 15 minute walk. The Uber to drive over there is like $28. Hmm? First stop, frozen drink. For real. <laughs> okay, so the guy gave us an upgrade. Hello. So we're at the Aria Hotel right now, about to go to their like sky cafe. So I guess it's a rooftop overlooking a pool, but it looks so cute on the inside. So the restaurant we're at is so cute. It's like. Um, it reminds me of Miami a little bit, like the outdoor, like tropical vibe. And like you would think that sitting outside, it'd be like super hot. They have air conditioning outside. Hi. How are you? Good. Doing great, thank you. Okay, look at the detail this hotel put into the Egyptian theme. Like, y'all, we took a two hour flight from Dallas to Egypt. So the girl y'all just saw in the last clip, her uncle is the head coach for the Lakers and she hooked us up with tickets to the Summer League game. Okay, so if you don't know what's going on here, Usher is walking into the club that we are about to go into. Got up. I don't know what it is. As y'all saw in the last clip, the club started playing Usher's music as soon as he walked in, mostly his throwbacks, and then some guys asked me and my friend to join them in their section, so we had some free drinks, we were just dancing, even the security guard came in and was just like singing and just vibing with us. It was honestly kind of funny. Oh, 
that's what you do, you're gonna So at this part of the night, some man grabs my arm and pulls me into this like secret room and basically it was because Usher was in there, it was the VIP VIP and we were having a good time. Okay, it's 4 a.m. and we both woke up at 5 a.m. this morning. <laughs> no, what was that? Ew, don't feel like this. Hey, y'all. <laughs> Just like I'm speechless. But yeah, y'all, we met Usher. We danced with him. We talked about him. Bro. Uh, I can't even talk about this right now. I'm gonna have to wait until the morning. I'm running on 23 hours of being awake. So no sleep. And I feel like I'm getting delusional at the moment. So I'll talk to y'all in the morning. It's day two of being in Las Vegas and we're just gonna walk the strip. Even though it's hot. Respect you like a lover Oh, 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 oh. So right now we're trying to find a daiquiri Because it's hot And we need some alcohol <laughs> inside of us <laughs> for like I think it's been an hour honestly it's hot but it's windy we also have our drinks so it's cooling us off a little bit but we're almost at our hotel thankfully and we're probably just gonna chill until the club tonight tonight we're going to rich the kid also free drinks crazy so hopefully tonight lives up to last night's expectations so i'm gonna do a little story time of what happened last night with usher mm. basically our friends who are also here were like hey we're going to mgm y'all want to come we came and we're waiting in this long ass line for the guest list and we come to find out we don't even need to wait in the guest list line so we go into this other line and we hear all these people screaming and we're like why are these people screaming like who is here so we turn we see it's usher right and so we get in me and hannah me. finesse we finesse our way to some guys section and we get free drinks after that we're just like moving around the club we see usher a couple times nothing serious but then some guy pulls my arm and i'm just like who is touching me like no i don't do that like don't be pulling me mm -hmm. so i look back they're all going to this room so i'm like you know what i think usher's in there so i pull hannah she pulled me <laughs> and we are in this vault like closed off room the when we enter the guys like no other girls like this is it 
So we go in and we see Usher. He's just standing there. We saw Usher. No, tell me why he's just standing there like it's nobody's business. Like he's just there like talking to people. And then eventually some people start to leave. So his security guards kind of back off. And Usher's just like there vibing with us. Like, with us, bro. We were dancing. We, like he's he like talked, right in front of us. Yeah, like he talked to us. He talked to you though. Yeah. Like I'm just thinking about the stuff we did like we didn't have like any intentions of like running into celebrity nope. but the fact that like he was like standing like right in front of us talking to us dancing with us we're like towards the end we were just vibing with him like we weren't like oh my god yeah we weren't like taking videos and stuff because he's such a chill person very was, humble i was so shook i was like i thought celebrities were like stuck up and like you like, know I got to experience with my bestie. I know. Nobody else. <laughs> it's just us two. We stuck together the whole night. Okay, I haven't been updating y'all about anything because we've really just been trying to figure ourselves out. Our flight doesn't leave until midnight, basically. And at the hotel that we were staying in before, we only had it for three days, but technically we're here for four days. Confusing, right? We are going to take pictures, get food, and then go to a beach club. The photo's about to drop soon. Oh, no, I can't be showing y'all too much. Every time I see you, you make my heart sad. So we're out here at the pool now, taking pictures. Some guy, <laughs> me and my girl, trying to take pictures, enjoy the moment. Why is it always men that gotta ruin everything? Like, we didn't need him. <laughs> Let me stop. Oh, they were good pictures, don't get it twisted. But he was doing a little too much to be persistent in taking our pictures. Like, no, he moved his chair, climbed on the rock. He squatted like girls squat to take pictures. Like, mister.